All right, this is my son's 2012 Dodge Charger. And the windshield wiper fluid is not coming out. So I checked the, the fuses, the fuses are fine. When I hit the, the washer fluid, I don't hear the motor. And this is what I get. No fluid. So what I'm gonna do is, I bought the, uh, the motor for the windshield wiper fluid. And you probably can't see it, but it's, it's all, all the way down there. The only way to get to it, take the wheel off and take the, the molding, the cover off, and we're gonna attack it through there. So the first thing we're gonna do is take the wheel off, jack it up, put it on jack stands, and work on pulling it out. All right, anytime you're, uh, you're jacking a car up and take the wheel off, first you're gonna loosen up the lug nuts while the car is on the ground. So we're gonna loosen up the lug nuts first, once they're loose, and then we'll get the jack underneath the car and jack it up. All right, now we got the car jacked up. It took me a minute to figure out where the actual jack goes. So what I did was, well, that's my neighbor leaving. 65 fastback. Um, so these are the, the points where I, I jacked it up here and then I put the jack stand here. Right in this lip over here. I ended up both sides. I jack up both sides because I don't want to. I don't want to twist twist the body or twist the frame. So now we're gonna take the wheel off. All right. Now we gotta take these clips off. Right here, basically. Let's pop one. All right, so I'm gonna peel this back. A little clips in here. Pull these out. If it was easy, everybody would do it. Ah. All right. That's the motor that's in there. We're gonna work on replacing that. Stop. So I got this pump at O'Reilly's. It was 30 bucks. The mechanic wanted to charge me like $450 to fix this. I'm not a car guy, I'm a mortgage broker, but I like my money and I try to if I can figure it out. I'm going to try to figure out and do it and save some money. All right, so the motor's right here. I'm going to lift this clip up and pull this out. And here is the, the drain. Try to get in there closer. The drain for the tube. This was on here. I'm going to pull this out. I'm going to pull this, this drain out, drain plug. All right, so I'm gonna plug this in in real quick. Before I put everything back together, I'm gonna plug it in and see if it works. All right, so I'm gonna go in the car. Over here, I'm gonna hit the, um, rock, over here. Foot off the brake, get the accessory going. I'm gonna press the wipers and is it here? Is it here? Can you hear it? Can you hear the motor? Yes. Yes, I hear the Alright, it's working. Alright. So now we know it works. Now we know it works, so we have to 
remove this old one should be just a twist all right so i'm loosening this up and it's just all going to come out i'm just going to lose all the fluid i don't know of another way to do it so here it goes and it's a mess okay so i had trouble trying to get this thing back in here um what i did was i took this rubber seal off so you take the rubber seal off put the rubber seal in here it's super easy to do just about So the rubber seal's in. Now I'm just gonna put this in here. <sighs> like a glove. Um, what am I gonna do now? Cause I kinda made a mess and got all this wet. I'm gonna let that dry before I plug everything back together. Um, so I'm gonna let it air dry for like probably a half hour to an hour. And I'll put everything back together. This can go back in. Okay, that's who goes back on there.